Hey, people. I talked about the power of the names in that last flick. Great flick. Don't miss it. I'll leave the link up here. And Crystal Blue Persuasion commented on it. Really, Denny, how do you not have millions of subs? I feel fortunate to be one of the few. And I thought I would have more subs, too, when I started this. I thought more people would be interested. But what I've learned, there's two types of people in the world. You know, there's those who think they already know and those that don't want to know. And once in a great while, once in a million, there's some of us aliens are born that just do the math and see things don't add up and want to know why things aren't adding up. So everything I talk about is taboo around here. And it comes from this magic spell that was put in the King James Bible. You know, change not a jot or a tittle. In Matthew 5, 18, you know, in one jot or one tittle shall in no wise pass from the law till it be fulfilled. And in Revelation, if any man shall add unto these things, God shall add him to the plagues that are written in this book. And if any man shall take away from the words of this book of the prophecy, God shall take away his part out of the book of life and the holy city. And so this church interprets that as why a person should read the King James Version Bible. That's the stupidest thing I've ever heard. Every letter's been changed. Every jot and tittle has been removed. And the people that interpret this, they'll plainly tell you that mm, they have no idea what all these jots and tittles mean. Just have some hypothesis. So yes, I'd like to have millions of views, mainly because it would better my chances of when I reincarnate, this information will come to me again. But I can understand the many reasons why people wouldn't want to share this. So in the words of Aminiatus, the tutor of into the octo, the tutor of the eight, you know, if I dare you, to jeeve to, to serve to the Logos, to carry of forces of a chariot of. And it came to me what this chariot of means. You know, back in the day, if you wanted somebody to do something, I dare you, I challenge you to, you know, to serve to the words, to carry of the forces, and the chariot of. The cherry goes on top, pretty please with a cherry on top, and so the force is on top. So I haven't checked it yet, but I'm taking a guess that if I go to the last chapter in the book of Zechariah, it's going to spell out the most powerful magic word of all time, please, you know, and into the octo, the eight, Aminiatus, the wife of Amini, a tutor of if I dare you achieve to the serve to the logos the carry of the forces on top the most powerful of all magic words pretty please with a cherry on taunt of and then in the next line it went to talking about the forces and you shall say to them thus is the lord of the forces so the of the forces you know it comes up here of to name on and you see it three times in this line of to name on the forces of to name on but if you look in the septuagint in this line three here you know the last time was the karyos the word of the lord to the names on to the powers to the powers but the first time it came up it was the words to the lord of the pantocrator and this is the one most of the time they interpret as the Almighty, the one on top. And so it means, you know, the pan, you know, the, the all around and to crater, you know, to govern. But it's, uh, it's to carry of a span, a span to govern. And so there's 12 spans across the heaven. You know, everybody gets their month, you know, and it's not necessarily the one on top but the one on top at that time and that's where the word you know dynamo comes from you know it's a uh, it's a turbine that generates power that inverts power from a diesel engine to a generator from a 
waterfall to a generator, you know, a dynamo, the forces. And so it turns, its power is in turning, and to name them on. And so this, the Lord of the forces, this is to carry in the Austin of value, a value to name on. And so the value of the name means several things. You know, the each name has a value, a letter value, a number value, a color value. But the only time these names would be valuable is in astrology. And so the reason I say a um, mini octus, the mini etus, a tutor of, is I'm reading that, that's how they would read the Egyptian. But the name lost meaning, it means into the octomony, the octomony, an omni a body, the, into the eight bodies it of, the tutor of, the teaching of the eight bodies. You see it in ex omni, you know, exo, the out of body, the practice of marrying outside the social group, the body, the village or tribe, outside the body, outside of the many. And so that's why I came back to read this, because I was reading in two and three, it was talking about Plato and Ptolemy. You know, back then, astrology had a lot more meaning. It was a medicine. And probably his most famous work, the Tetrabiblos, that uh, they interpret as four books, and that's just totally off. It's, this means to see and in order. You know, bow, blow by blow by blows in the order in the Tetra the Tetravi blows to see in order. You see this is the name of the book in all of the the origins and all the genealogies. And you see it better in the Hebrew is is the cipher, the cipher, the numbers, the words, the letters, the you know, code. It is the cipher told it had them by by them bear, you know, and all your ancient Bibles, that's what they wrote the birth of children, the death of grandpa, and all the properties and dealings, purchases that have been made, were all in this family book. And it was a book of revival, the Bible as, as what happened during life, revival, tetravival, to see life as. But the eight bodies, you know, this is the stars, the fixed stars. And then you have the bodies. You have the Saturn, Jupiter, Mars, Sun, Venus, Mercury, and the Moon. You only have seven bodies here. And then you have the Earth. You know, this tells me that they knew the Earth was just another one of the planetary bodies. You see them in this old artwork, you know, looking at the Moon and saying, Oh, that's the same as what I'm standing on. So I don't trust all these names. I'm pretty sure that these are the names of the books. And the reason I interpret this as to see by blows is because it was written in the coin in the Biblical Greek from an Egyptian 100 A.D. And in the next paragraph, the vision of the four horses where all four, all three of these words mean vision. And the Tetrati, we Akkadian to indicate a many of the body out as to indicate um, omni the body out as and the tetrati you know that was a fourth to the Greeks but that was the sight to the Egyptians and not just the sight but the thalamus and they knew that the picture that you seen in your brain had to be converted into thalamus and the Tetrati, and the sight that we Akkadian, you know, we bring, we caddy, we bring the tools, we bring you, your golf clubs to indicate of the body a many, indicate omni, uh, out of a summon, a summon to cause a bat in to the tutor. You know, bring bad in and teach us something. And it, it, they, if I dare you, to serve to the jeeve, to the logos, 
to carry a forces that cherry on taunt of. And so in here, you'll see that they changed the word from the power. It's just now in the mist, you know. It's just a name is on. So it's no power just having a name, but when you know what the name goes to, the two name on the dynamos, that's when it becomes a power. And so vision means to see, you know, and four means to see in horses. And they start the next line with that, you know, the horse, the horoscope in horse to see. But not just, you know, raw to see, but the horse, the eye of horse to see. And so the horse in knocked of yacht of honor, you know, the hand of honor to pass it over. And Nocta isn't really night. Nocta is the things that happen at night, and it's the secrets of, of us to, and us to of no yada to know. And so this really isn't even an N. It's as red as an I. You know, the horse hit any, any, and us to, and us to have hand of, to know of, honor. And the five, the five because, the five because, this is where, when, what, how, and who. And the five because, if he on fury, on, and out, and out as his tellage, and his, his tellage is their, their stellage, you know, the stars. And the stellage a name is on. And the name is on the to to nor to nor haunting you know, the hauntings with you to nor on the north a cod according to the sky on and a piso and the floor the level a piso. You know, of the sky and of the floor to of to wife ye of to wife ye fury, who a loose, and a pokalo. And so uh, what I've learned from this chapter, you know, I've, I change up vowel combinations often. And what I've learned from this chapter is this O-I replaces the E in Hebrew, just to be read as the or E. And you see it in this word, moi, which is just the M-E. And often just by itself, where they'll say it means the, and they'll say that's what this word means all the time, is the. Even when they don't give it a meaning here, they'll still tell you that it means the. You know, you can sit with the S, you know, these, and, and these have a call is on, the ones whom accused. That's why you see four and five vowel combinations in Greek, and you can't figure out how to read it. But, you know, the horses, you know, are of to a whip, W-I-P, and the second P turned to a Y, I, and E, and to whip ye, that's where that comes from. You know, a, a yippee ka yay, you know, and the horses, and let them be, yippee ka yay, and the, and the sky and the floor of to whip ye, a fury, you know, F-U-R-Y, a fury, and E in who a loose or a loose L A U C E, you know, uh, lucent isn't white. It's you know translucent, is to allow the the light through. So whatever color it is, you know, it's loose. It's coming through. And this is most surely where our word for polka dot comes from. So it's describing the plate with the with the name on. And so it goes on with these names on here. You know, I would show to you what these are. This, you know, just standing in the mist that the name is on. And if you look over in the Hebrew, it changes to among the myrtle trees, you know, and it's it's by need, by needs, by N E E D S, by needs them. But this is the bin and it's a it's vin. It means the the date of the vin. You know, the number that tells everything about your vehicle. It tells the five because, you know, when, where, what, how, and why. And so to get a better idea of what's going on, you know, in the beginning is when he started the names on. You know, in the beginning created, 
and then the first day and let there be or and was the or and saw light was good and divided it of vin divided of in the hour of the hour of vin each shack the vin the vin numbers the qualities to put on it and you see that over here in the Greek the creation and God saw the light was good and he parted of those a name is on two and two of photos to the photos and a name is on to a scotos to the to the pictures and his coat was in the color a name is on the photos and a name is on two was coat twos to the color he is wearing and so the reason this has anything to do with anything is because that was the first law of God and God said let their cause we we jeeve to we serve to cause you know the five causes when where why who and how come from the cosmos from above and let their cause we serve to cause you know in the name the vin of the hour the cause of in each shack and so that's what's doing is on the first page is telling you where to place everything in its position the hour of on each shack and then the next day you know let there be a firm in the midst and and let divide the, the names on so was made and divided the names on and then on the third day he didn't divide the names on the waters he gathered them together because the names you know the the waters the motion the motions are the same whether they're above or below you don't see it again until the fourth day with the sun moon and stars and let there be lights in the firmament of the heavens to divide the name is on the name is on the day and of the and of in the name is on the lily the, the light and let them be for signs and over the night you know and and of the the light will of the vittle will fill the names of the hour and the names of each shack where all him the sit the sit of and there's no naming on the fifth day but on the sixth day he made man in our image and likeness to rule to let them rule over the fish of the sea you know the the word of digit the word of number him it didn't make every man to rule over just the ones with nose the nose had them the ones that could smell out some bullshit the nose had them in excel them in and could and could them what knew of the word of digits of the numbers him of hope hope is another word for faith you know in the digit him of hope is in m i m is n is in you know so not everybody was made in god's image just those with a nose had them the ones can sniff out some bullshit so this channel's called strictly educational magic this means i don't practice it's just educational but when y'all see me drop this educational off you know it's because i have perfected and i'll be saying things like if i dare you achieve to the logos to share a pretty please a pretty please with a cherry and taunt of barack you why of add it on profit and legend in a rock you in thunder barack in thunder you who have added on profit and legend so the two most powerful magic spells are it is true because god said not one jot or tittle is going to be changed but the most powerful of all the pan to crater is pretty please you know the forces of a cherry on taunt of the cherries on taunted of a pretty please with a cherry on top please don't believe that bullshit that king james told you you know they know how the mind works and and just an image 
can make you smell something. I see this all the time. A commercial comes up and I can smell the food. And why does the dog sniff the ass, you know? is because what's some buckhole, what's a clue, what a cur, what's new. Hey, where you been? What you been doing? That's what that means. So I'm going to cut this off here. And I'm going to read the first day or two in the Greek in the next movie. And it's going to give you a whole different picture of what you thought God was. Good day.